was filed last week uh, from LA court of a store manager accusing, I think it's Dov Charney? Yes. The, again, I might butcher his name. He's the CEO of American Apparel, and he apparently choked a store manager and threw dirt at him and deriding him with anti gay slur. So the for, former manager filed, um, his name was Michael Bubbles. Kind of makes me want to say Michael Bubbles. Well, I was thinking of finding Nemo, not out of a parent. <laughs> like everything. Remember the guy who like, just play bubbles? He's in the tank with Nemo. You know, he yeah, Do you know they're coming out with part two? I know. He's found. Like, where is he? Where is he going to go? <laughs> I know. Finding Nemo. Identifying Nemo. <laughs> <laughs> that's going to be back. It's finding Dora. She can't remember herself. Um, so the company, I mean, it's they're known for being everything made in the U.S., shipped in the U.S., everything like that. And since the company started in 89, he's actually had multiple acquisitions from them uh, between having employees perform oral sex and showing up the, in the office in underwear. And in 2011, five women sued him for sexual harassment. I mean, he doesn't really have a clean record. How does he, this guy keep going? That's my question. You know, he's like the Playboy CEO here, right? Yeah. It's, I mean, do we ever say whatever? Well, have you actually read this guy's record? Because when you sent me this story, I went back just to, just, just for giggles to look at it. And there is some pretty amazing stuff. I mean, this guy <laughs> is crazy. Yeah. Like, we're not just talking like, hey, sweetie, you know. Mm. <laughs> we're not talking about, you know, doing like pistol fingers here. I mean, we're talking like, you know, some heinous stuff. Yeah. And it just, it gets to a point where, you know, there's so much smoke at a point, how is, it, is there not fire there? I mean, yeah, yeah. who is this guy's attorney? That's what I want to know because I need him. <laughs> but, I mean, that's I, how does this guy get it off? Because this stuff is crazy. Well, I mean, I, I don't know. I mean, in the sense of the company, isn't there a board of directors? Isn't there, how can you be, how can you still be running the business? Continue these. With things. all these, yeah. I mean, doesn't. For the better of the business, isn't there someone that says, hey, you know, get out of office or get out of here? I mean, one of the things he called Bubbles was a wannabe Jew. And I, I don't understand, like, why. How does that work? Yeah, he's uh, Jewish, correct? Yeah, well, the Charney is Jewish, not Bubbles. Okay. Is Bubbles Jew? I don't know if he is, but he, uh, Charney called him um, a ra um, an anti gay slur and then called him a wannabe Jew, which, for me, I don't understand how that I don't know. I don't understand that. I, I mean, I think he needs to be replaced if that company is in the last song. Because now it's like what you said the last topic. It's more social responsibility of people want to do business with. Well, they've expanded their business now. I mean, they're not doing. I mean, the business model there has evolved a lot. Now they're involving families yeah. and yep. clothes. And if your mom, you know, and you're taking your kids. Much rather go to an Eblins at this point right. yeah. than this place. So I mean, it's 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 getting bad for probably. I mean, somebody's got to step in. I mean, regardless of what it is. <laughs>